You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video. And by Utech, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. CES Live. CES Live 2015. I am here with Adam Zeiss. I'm Adam Zeiss. This is my friend Rene Ritchie. We are here in this wonderful stage built once again by the awesome Geek Beat crew. We've got the Mobile Nations bullpen behind us. We have Tom's Guide coming up. Uh, it's, it's a fantastic show, Adam. So far, so good, I'd like to say. You want to do one more sexy, amazing product? We can try. All right, now are you going to get the name right or should I do it this time? You know time? what? I just realized as we went live, I realized that I have the name of the product nailed down. But I'm hoping that it's pronounced Davion, is that right? Yeah, that's correct. Oh, that's correct. Yeah. Renee, nice to meet you. Good Welcome job. to the show. Good Welcome. job. Thank you. Thank you for having now me. Now it's pronounced Shot Tracker. Shot, shot tracker. tracker. If you're American or yes. Canadian, Shot Tracker. So this sounds to me like it's something designed to track shots. <laughs> you're brilliant. Big that brain on awesome. Brett. Like Big brain on awesome. Brett. Like that is guy. what we do. <laughs> so we're a wearable technology that automatically tracks your basketball shot attempts, makes misses, and plots real time statistics for basketball did you, players. Did you play basketball? A little bit. Can I, why did you guys wear heels and not tell me? <laughs> this is, I felt tall the whole time because we had everybody up here and now I'm just like, uh, I don't really okay. wear heels to these type of events. <laughs> Still Brings out my eyes. <laughs> me too. <laughs> All right, so sorry, you were telling us, uh, you, so you decided that technology could help people track their shots. Yeah, that's right. You know, when I played in college, so I'm originally from Trinidad and Tobago, got a basketball scholarship uh, to play out in Kansas. And, um, you know, during the summers, every day I would actually shoot 500 to 1,000 jump shots, but it was a true manual process. And you know, when my co-founder brought the idea to me, I thought it was, it just resonated really well. And uh, we got together about a little over a year ago, and now we're shipping product, and we're at CES, and I'm here with you guys, so. And he's pumped to be here. He's more excited than we are, and I'm super excited That's that he's excited. That's impossible, Adam. It's amazing. All right, so how does this work? I mean, intellectually, I like the idea that I'm going to make a shot, and computers are going to do the rest, like yeah. magic. Yeah. So how do you, you had to do a lot of hard work to make this. There was a lot of hard work. You know, you had to make a device. The, the, the toughest thing was really building a device. Basketball is a, a game of motion, a game of activity, right? So we had to build this device that would ignore shot attempts, dribbles, passes, and only track your shot. So we built a, a patent pending algorithm that would actually use the raw data coming out from an IMU, and we're able to figure out the shot, everybody's jump shot. Now the thing about jump shots is that they're very unique. They're like a fingerprint. So your jump shot is different from mine. So on the fly, once you shoot five shots, we identify what your shot profile it's looks like. Like your shot fingerprint. Exactly, pretty much. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna patent that. Shot now. ID. <laughs> you heard it here shot first, ID. shot ID. We call it your shot profile, and we can automatically track your shot attempts. And then this device goes in the net, it just clicks onto the net like this, and now we understand where you're shooting versus structured workouts, whether you sh sh when you shot it, if you made it or not, and we can plot real-time statistics. Um, this device can either go into a, a shooting sleeve, nice. or it could also go into a wristband. Now, is it true that you did all your really hard testing on the Harlem, Harlem Globetrotters? <laughs> is that how you got the algorithm perfected? <laughs> no, we Stop did not. Stop spinning! Stop spinning! No, no! Spinning lines, Renee. Shoot we did the not. ball! <laughs> no, we did test it on some really horrible shooters, though. Did you? Uh, we saw did you everything test this from Renee? the shot. I put. know. You know what? I, I have was, no idea. I, I I was so bad I didn't even answer the phone. <laughs> <laughs> we tried to get him. He's they busy. tried to get so, him. So so the whole process. So I take the sleeve or the wristband, and then I throw this guy in it. Is that yeah, how it that's works? right. So literally, you just put it in here. Okay. And uh, you turn it on, and once you put it in here, you're good to go. You put okay. this on the net, and uh, this got a shoot to wait functionality, so you can leave it up there. Okay. Shoot, it wakes up, you connect via Bluetooth low energy to your device, okay. and uh, you're, you're tracking shots. And what is it, what is it, what am I getting? Like, so if I pull out my iPhone and Android, just yeah, iPhone? Yeah, that's right, both? iPhone okay. and Android. So I pull out my phone and then I have the app and it's going to tell me what? Yeah, so the app has workouts, it has drills that you can follow for structured workout. It's okay. going to tell you where you shot based on those structured locations. It's going to tell you how many you made, how many you missed. Okay. You know, a lot of people think that we're about making you a better shooter. Basketball is like repetition. It's not necessarily like golf, right? Where sure. if you come outside, you're going to see the implications of going right. <laughs> We've seen some of the ugly jumpers be some of the, <laughs> the better shooters, you know? Yeah, so digital it's about accountability. He wants to know if he's going to help him with his free throw. He says he's deadly from the three-point line. Is that right? Yeah. We're, we're, hey, we're going to have to have a challenge. That's one of the <laughs> other cool things. You know, we're going to challenge him in Canada in nice. real time. Nice. So it's a lot of fun. Basketball is a fine Canadian game. Did you know that, Adam? I, I had no Nate idea. Smith. Yeah. 
There you go. Video. History, right here, man. Yeah, I thought History. only hockey was from Canada and uh, curling. So much to I teach no him, idea. so little CES Live. Uh, so is, it's going to tell me um, where I'm shooting from, things like that? That's correct. And Shot attempts makes misses. Okay. Yeah, and then there's also a coaches app where okay. coaches could actually do drills and push them to their different players. Okay. And then in real time, they can get the stats of how their players performed in the workouts. So I can do, like you were saying, like real-time things. So like I, my best friend I used to play ball with lives in DC, yep. and I'm in Jersey, so we can throw down and compare on the app. And exactly, see exactly. You can, do, you can do a workout, challenge him. Okay. Uh, this, uh, this, this month we're launching multiplayer. So you know, if you've got three or four people at your house, you could all be shooting at the same time with one net sensor, okay. multiple wrists. And then by yourself in Jersey, you could do asynchronous gameplay. I could. <laughs> or we could get Kevin into basketball. I feel like Kevin, just for the fact that it's competition, and it's something is to do with technology. Is he paying you per mention? Like you get, you get 10 bucks every time you mention no, his name? Uh, no. But I feel like yes. if he were into basketball, he would be totally into this because it's competition and he would want to be better than everyone else. That's $30 Even for if everyone he wasn't, to keep track at home. You can send yeah. your text to me. Thank Our you Our offices much. are a lot, a lot of fun because you know, anytime we're testing, we may run a shooting game and yeah. people don't want to lose. We, we did it at the Final Four with AT&T uh, okay. in 2014 and uh, they brought some of the players the night before. They opened up the bracket town and they didn't want to leave because they kept going back and forth, run it back, run it back, because you know different <laughs> sure. people were winning. Well, so. I don't have yeah. Adam's amazing basketball skills, and that's actually humbling <laughs> to me. So this makes me feel like I could practice on my own and get better and not have to be humiliated on the court. That is possible. I mean, Even for you, Renee, it's yes, not it's miracle worker. <laughs> well, maybe but, not. For you know, you, you got to have a little bit of talent. <laughs> But yes, we can definitely think well, we I'm can get you Well, I'm pitching the commercial better. where I'm just thinking, I'm just thinking shots, and then it pans away and it pans back, and like it's Jordan or Shaquille <laughs> O'Neal or somebody, <laughs> you know, it's just yeah, it, it's aspirational. It's not a lie, yeah. but you know, it makes me feel better about myself. Uh, what's the breakdown as far as pricing and availability and things like that? So we are available for purchase right now on ShotTracker.com. Okay. Uh, the price is one forty nine. And that's 99. for all this stuff. That, that we is have for here? all of this stuff. Cool. Um, and if you I can just buy to get additional trackers. Uh, yeah, you can actually buy additional friends. trackers. Those are seventy nine ninety nine. Okay. For additional trackers, so we've seen families buy one set and mm -hmm. two additional trackers because they've got three kids. And sure. with the launch that um, the the functionality functionality we're pushing out this month, uh, they'll be able to play multiplayer games and also shoot and work out multiplayer. What's the battery life like? What's the charging like? How does all that work? Yeah, so it comes with this charger, which is a very neat charger that we've built. Um, it, it allows us to to charge both items. Um, at the same time, the important thing about really doing a charger was allowing us to make this, you know, as waterproof as possible because we don't have any openings, right? So we wanted to build a charger. Uh, this you can get anywhere from one to three months on the net. Oh wow! Um, depending on how many times you shoot, um, the wrist sensor gives you about four to eight hours depending on usage. So I can throw that guy in my net and leave it up for a while. Is he gonna? Tell me when the battery's dying. Yes, yes. So Within the app, it'll say, hey, you're at 20%, similar to how, like how your mobile phone does. Sure. Very cool. Gordon McLeod wants to know if this will help him with his shot, his, uh, shot ability from the bar, at the bar. <laughs> you know what? We haven't trained that. We okay. haven't tried that. But that's, um, you know, we've heard that question a couple times, but we haven't really tried that. I, feel like I guess be the we same have some implementation. I mean, it's I guess all we need to meet up tonight and all get on some wrist sensors and test it out. So yeah, you just gave him a new idea. Not, nothing but net, Gord. Nothing <laughs> but net. Not shot tracker. It's <laughs> well, I'm sure like the tracker. college kids had a little hoops ball on the on the door, right? <laughs> they want to know the, the paper bag. Like you know, they have a lot of uses for this, Adam. We had a question in the chat too. Can it be used for other sports? We have somebody asking if it can be used for hockey players or other things. I mean, not maybe not this particular one, but down the road. Do you so have the good news is that, uh, and this was actually very funny for me because I got a tweet. Uh, about a week ago where somebody put it on a lacrosse net <laughs> and actually trained a lacrosse test, okay. a cross shot. Now, you know, the umbrella company here is DD Sports, which stands for Data Driven Sports. Shot Tracker is the first market that we're focusing on. Okay. Our goal in the future is to be able to extrapolate to other sports. Um, right now, we're really focused on basketball, but what it's helping us doing is getting the form factor, all of our algorithms, and we're building it in a way that we can scale it in the future. Cool. So today, no, future, yes. Where the puck is going to be, Adam. Well, because I don't know if you know this or not, but I'm pretty sure hockey is Canadian. Hockey, I've heard of this. And I think I've heard of A little team also. called the Canadians. It's Way better than the, than the Devils, right? Uh, pretty much everyone are better than the Devils at this point. <laughs> we don't have a lot of good sports teams left in New Jersey. I don't know if you know that or not, but. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's, it's, it's hard to breaking in front of me. It's painful Everybody to picks on me for no reason. So you would why. use this, Adam, right? I would, you know, surprisingly, believe it or not, basketball was actually the one sport that I was ever any good at. 
Um, but we just, my son's 12 and he just started to get into basketball. We got a basketball yeah. hoop uh, like six months ago. But I feel like it's something good for him because he's, you know, he's a kid. Yeah. And he still either hucks it like this or he throws it like this. Or oh, it's going to be great does for these kids. Things. You know, he doesn't have the, the good shot down. So I feel like it would be helpful for him. Are you seeing just any to breakdown yet? Like kind of train. Who's going towards Is it professional athletes? Is it the people at home? Is it the kids? I'll tell you what, we have really focused on the seven to 21, 24 year old market. Mm -hmm. um, one, because of scale and quantity. Sure. <laughs> There's only about 50,000, you know, pros and college players. Yeah. Um, but we are working with a few, you know, pros. I uh, can't mention any yet, but we're working yeah. on some deals right now with some pros, more cool. for, you know, endorsement. Yeah. Um, but we've really seen kids from anywhere from probably eight and up just really excited about it, challenging their friends. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, you got the old guys like me who <laughs> used to have game, who still think they got a little bit of game, yeah. you know, and we're, we're All you, you know, gotta do office. is have better game than the guy next to you. That's yeah. the only thing that matters. Pretty well, much, I exactly. feel like my son would love this. I mean, just, you know, cause they're all into video games now, like he loves everything yeah. electronic. So rather than us just going out and shooting hoops, you know, we could shoot hoops and then he'd be able to pull it up and say, yeah. you know, look at all this think stuff, of this I'm better than you and I can prove it. And Xbox like, oh. Live for outside, right? So now you're, you're, you've got the gamification components, but sure. you're actually outside, getting it done, sweating, winning. being active. Winning, winning. winning. Adam. Yeah. <laughs> Ultimate gamification, yeah, winning. Renee. So what's the availability? Uh, it's available right now. Uh, we're shipping products. We made a small batch that we made for uh, prior to Christmas, and in two weeks we sold out of that batch, oh, nice. which was very exciting. It was it was not a humongous number, but it was a decent size for us. Um, we're learning. We've learned a ton from that, and um, we're we're adding different things into the app that our customers are requiring. And um, yeah, people can purchase them right now. Where do they go if they want to get it? Shottracker.com. S-H-O-T-T-R-A-C-K-E-R. Just that easy. Shottracker.com. Shot. Just that easy. Tracker. That easy. Shot tracker. I got it. Uh, awesome. Anything? What is your favorite use for this? Playing basketball. Yeah, basketball. No. Uh, <laughs> my favorite use, you know, for me, I, uh, I'm not a, in college, I used to hate running when coach made <laughs> us run, you know? Like, I was that guy. I only ran because I had to and I was a leader <laughs> on the team, so I couldn't slack. Right. So I had to get after it, right? But I just hate to run. So how I use it right now is I'll go to the gym and get two, 300 shots up and uh, work out it with makes a partner. It and it makes it a lot more fun. And after I'm checking to see how I did and did <laughs> I progress last time. And you know, and then when, you know, now I know my spots and awesome. you know, so it's, it's a lot of fun even for old guys like me. Very cool. Awesome. Adam, I'm impressed. I'm impressed too. We appreciate it. Thanks Thank so you. much for coming on. Yeah, so really much. Cool. Was, you guys made it fun. Thanks for Thank having me. Thank you chat room for asking smarter questions than us, frankly. Uh, this is Adam Zeiss. Still Adam Zeiss. Still Renee Ritchie. CES Live, we're going to be here all week. Do not change that virtual internet channel. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Never do it. <laughs>